Hello everyone and welcome to my top five favourite Christmas horror movies. Uh, so I hope you enjoy it. Let me know your favourite Christmas horror movies in the comment section below. If you like this video I'd really appreciate if you give it a like. Also if you do enjoy my videos please hit the subscribe button so you know when I upload the next one. Number five is Silent Night, Deadly Night. Uh, after watching this one only a few years ago, it's become one that I need to watch at Christmas time. Really love it. Um, everyone goes nuts for this one over Christmas as I see pictures of Billy circulating over social media. When this film was released, I read that angered parents stood outside the theatres of where this film was being shown, asking passers-by to sign a petition to get it removed, and apparently two weeks later, the movie had to be withdrawn. Merry Christmas, everyone. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Number four is Black Christmas 2006. A lot of people don't like this remake, but I like it. It's fun, it's campy and very over the top. Also, I said in my last video that I adore Katie Cassidy, so this movie gets a thumbs up from me. Also, if you didn't know, Angie Martin, who played the house mother in the remake, is actually Phil from the original Black Christmas. Uh, literally, I just found that out. Gobsmacked. So number three is Krampus. Uh, anything with Tony Collette in is just great. Uh, this one is a really a lot of fun to watch. It's very interesting and it makes you want to read up on all the information regarding Krampus. I also love the comedy moments in this movie. I also just found out that Seth Green was one of the voices of the gingerbread men. Um, also, the snow on the ground in the actual film, uh, it's apparently it comes from different sources but mostly it comes from diapers. Number two goes to Black Christmas, 1974. Um, I love this movie so much. I love to watch it uh, nearer towards Christmas so it feels a little bit more like Christmas. So I get very excited when it comes along to watching this one. So if you didn't know, Bob Clark was working on a sequel back in 2007 after the release of the remake. Uh, he had already thought of a plan for the film, but tragically he died in a car crash due to a drunk driver. So my number one is Gremlins, my favourite all-time Christmas horror movie. I have a tradition to watch it every Christmas Eve night and open one present in my household. I won't be able to do it this year due to uh, working 15 hour shifts on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, but I could just change it to another day. So according to Joe Dente, uh, Zach Gilligan was the first to point out that the rule of no eating after midnight was silly because it was always midnight somewhere. Uh, this is apparently why they made fun of it in Gremlins 2. <laughs> so there you have my top 5 favourite Christmas horror films. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching and I hope you all have a very Merry Christmas. Bye.